getting very desperate. He has posted these flyers all across town. He is offering a cash reward and even a free performance too, if you can help him out. When I saw everything missing, it was just, like literally my breath was taken away, like I got hit. Local musician Kevin Scott wants you to take a close look at this surveillance video. You can see a man going into his car, taking out his speakers and other expensive gear Wednesday morning. Scott says he left the gear in his car because he didn't want the gear to get wet in the stormy weather, something he regrets. And this was just a, uh, just a complete setback. So I was just like, whoa. What would you say to the person who has your gear right now? If you could talk to him. Just please give me back my gear. <laughs> I need my gear to work. It's gut wrenching. Um... Yeah. It's emotional. Yeah, it really is. And I just, I don't, mm, I don't know. His wife, Kara Kirkland, says they always lock their car. They think the man somehow got into the car after it was damaged when it was recently stolen. Because of the pandemic, they couldn't afford the repairs. A year ago, our car got stolen twice in 36 hours. So this isn't even our first time dealing with this. But this feels so much more personal than our car being stolen. It's real close to our heart, you know. And to make matters worse, Scott has a gig tonight, but no gear. When you steal musical equipment from musicians, you're affecting their livelihood for their families. It feels crazy. <laughs> So a very emotional day for this family. No arrests have been made. If you have any information, call police. Reporting live in New Orleans, I'm Aubrey Killian, WDSU News. All right, Aubrey, thank you.